Hi, I'm John Hirabayashi, CEO of Community First Credit Union. On behalf of our entire team at Community First Credit Union, I'd like to congratulate 2020's many graduating high school classes in Northeast Florida. We know graduation celebrations will be different than you expected this year, and while nothing can replace the in-person celebrations you'd plan with friends and family, we're glad to partner with News for Jacks and High School 912 on this first-of-a-kind virtual celebration to congratulate each of you for reaching your graduation milestone. I'm sure you're feeling a lot of different emotions right now. Moving beyond high school presents a world of challenge and excitement. Maybe you're going to college right away. Maybe you're going directly into the workforce or enlisting in our armed forces. Whichever path you choose, there are new experiences and excitement coming your way. At Community First Credit Union, we salute you as North Florida's brightest and best. Congratulations to each of you on your big day. The COVID-19 pandemic has changed the way most of us live. As you can see, this card table has become my anchor desk from inside my home. Safer at home orders and social distancing guidelines have stopped our daily routines and kept us apart from familiar faces like our coworkers, friends, and in some cases, family members. One group especially impacted by this worldwide crisis students. Especially graduating seniors who've had some of life's most precious memories taken from them. From school gatherings to sporting events and in some cases graduation ceremonies. That's why Channel 4 and High School 912 are proud to partner on Brightest and Best, celebrating the class of 2020. The local station takes pride in being part of our communities and believes it's important to recognize this year's grads for their hard work and determination in overcoming these challenging circumstances. To our graduating seniors and the teachers, administrators, and parents who helped them along the way, we say congratulations and good luck. Channel 4, the local station, and High School 912 are proud to present Brightest and Best, celebrating the class of 2020. Brought to you by Community First Credit Union. Greetings, everyone. I'm Dr. John Avendano, President of Florida State College, Jacksonville. And on behalf of the Board of Trustees, our faculty, our staff, and our administration, and your colleagues, the students, we want to extend our heartfelt congratulations to each and every one of our graduates of the class of 2020. This year has been a strange year, as we can all admit, and it's been an abnormal finish to our semester. This is going to be an abnormal ceremony. Nevertheless, it doesn't take away from the accomplishments that each and every one of you have had as part of the FSCJ family. I want to welcome all of you to the FSCJ Alumni Association as well. Please know that we're proud of each and every one of you. We're excited for all of you. We're excited for your family members and your loved ones who helped you get to this point. We know that this class has an, a lot of excellent, outstanding graduates. We're proud of the fact that you showed your perseverance, your resilience, your commitment to your, continue your education throughout the school year. That's a sign of things to come. That's the sign of your ability to overcome obstacles, which is a trademark of Florida State College of Jacksonville. Our students will overcome anything. This has just been a trial in your life, and we have every confidence you're going to continue to overcome things in the future. Know that this is a preview of our commencement ceremony that will launch on July 2nd. Until then, please know that we're proud of every one of you and enjoy the videos that we have celebrating your excellence and your accomplishments. This class has a number of outstanding graduates. This class has those who will become our community leaders in business and in industry. This class has educators who are going to serve to educate our children, educate our high school students, and in the future, maybe educate your future colleagues as well in college. This class has uh, civic leaders, civil leaders in it, who are going to be first responders and healthcare professionals, engineers, business people, those who will become the economic engine for our community. Know that we're proud of each and every one of you. Know that FSCJ will always be here for your future. We're excited that we were part of your educational past, but we're going to be even more excited when we can provide you with your educational future as well. FSCJ is always here for you. We are this community's college. 
We're excited for your accomplishment, and we're looking forward to the things that you will do in the future. Until then, enjoy your time, celebrate your accomplishments, know that you are above everybody else due to the hardships that you've overcome to accomplish what you have done over this past year. The class of 2020 has much to be proud of, and we're proud of each and every one of you. Congratulations to all of our graduates. Hello, FSCJ graduates, class of 2020. I'm Mac McGee. I am chairman of the District Board of Trustees, and I get to bring some remarks to you on behalf of the entire board. As I was going through preparations for this, I started thinking back into my life. You know, it was about 39 years ago I went through this very moment that you were going through. And the flashback took me to all the people that had a hand in giving me the opportunity to be at this point. There was my mother and father. There were teachers. There was one dean of the business college at the University of Florida that took a chance on me and gave me an opportunity to prove myself. And prove myself, I did. Each of you has proved yourself capable and willing and finally, it shows in a graduate degree that you are now getting today. Now, let me warn you that you may think that your education is done, but I'm 60 years old and I am still learning. I have mentors that are involved in my life, and I just challenge you to look for individuals that can continue with your education as you go through life because this isn't all the education you're gonna have. It's gonna go on and on uh, for the rest of your life. And remember this, at one point there's gonna be a transition where you can provide that leadership, that mentorship to other people that are looking up to you because of what you've been able to accomplish. So be ready and able to give back to those who are looking up to you and for all of your accomplishments. Congratulations, I am so sorry that we aren't able to do this in person. You know, I've been on this board for a real long time and I thoroughly enjoy each of those graduations where we've been in the large arena and we have student after student or graduate after graduate cross the stage and we hear the smatterings of applause. In some cases, we hear some very loud hoots and hollers of family members that are congratulating either their son, their daughter, their mother or father, or in some cases, their grandparent who are receiving degrees. I miss that, but that doesn't take back anything from the accomplishments that you have done. Enjoy yourselves, look forward to the next day with eager anticipation, and hopefully we'll see you back here, either as another student or maybe as faculty. Congratulations, class of 2020.
Hello, FSCJ grads, or as I say to my students, hi, totally, totally neighbors. Um, if you've been my student, then you know who I am. Otherwise, I am Dr. John A. Woodward. I'm president of the Faculty Senate. I'm a professor of the humanities and film studies. And I just want to say how proud I am of all of you, my students, and those who weren't my students, um, for everything that you've accomplished and everything that you've achieved in this semester, which has been probably one of the most difficult semesters of my entire life, um, and certainly of my career, and for your entire career here at the college. We collectively, as the faculty, are very, very proud of you. We are very, very proud of what you've accomplished, and we wish you all the best in your lives. Hopefully, part of that will continue to be with us. We encourage you to um, appreciate your family members. I remember the first time I graduated, the first of however many times I graduated. Um, it, was, it was wonderful to have my family with me at every single one of them. And it was, it was very important for me to be able to appreciate them um, and everything that they had done for me as a college student. So I hope you are able to reach out to family and friends who have been supportive of you. We certainly think of you in these times and we wish you the best. Congratulations uh, from all the faculty and certainly from me. Uh, congratulations. Au revoir. Ciao. A bientôt. Hello, everyone. My name is Sequoia Williams, your 2019-2020 Student Government Association College White President. On behalf of FSCJ, I want to start by congratulating all of you for making it this far. I know times may be difficult right now, but together we must unite and continue to move forward. I want to thank everyone who has helped the class of 2020 get to where we are right now. Thank you guys for your support, your love, helping us study wherever it may be. Thank you guys. Um, I want to thank my family, my friends, my daughter Lauren, who is graduating VPK this year. So congratulations to her. The celebration might not be what we originally thought it would be, but we are still here to celebrate all of you. So get dressed up for our Ju July 2nd graduation day. Get dressed up, take pictures, enjoy yourself, have a good time because it's still a celebration and we're celebrating you. Congratulations, class of 2020. FSCJ extends its congratulations to our bachelor's degree graduates. Congratulations to each and every one of you. We look forward to the impact you will make in our community. Our FSCJ bachelor's degree graduates are one of 13 different programs that we offer here at FSCJ. Congratulations to each and every one of you and we wish you nothing but the best.
Hi, I'm Dr. John Wall, Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs. In our community, FSC, FSCJ students are recognized for their commitment to their education and their ability to balance work life, home life, and pursue their educational goals. With this crazy pandemic, you guys have risen to the occasion more than any other class I can think of. I'm awed of your uh, accomplishments, so proud of you, and I wish you the very best success as you move forward. If we can ever do anything for you, please let us know. Congratulations, FSCJ grad. The FSCJ family extends its congratulations to our Associate and Arts degree graduates today. Congratulations to each and every one of you. We look forward to see what you do in the future. Please know that FSCJ is here for you as you continue your education and will be here in the future regardless of your career options. Congratulations to all of our AA degree graduates today.
congratulations, class of 2020. I have the trust that you are well prepared to succeed in your professional life. I wish you best of luck and please always remember we are here to help you whenever you need. Good luck. Hey FSCJ, congratulations on your graduation, a job well done. Since we can't be there with you in person to celebrate as part of the grad crew, here's a virtual high five from me and my buddy back here. Congratulations once again, all the best. Wish you nothing but success in the future. Congratulations to all of you graduates. Your hard work and dedication has not gone unnoticed. Um, this world desperately needs people like you who are committed to pursuing truth and knowledge. I wish you all a lifetime of success and continued learning. Graduates, I just want to say I'm so proud of you. You guys did such a great job. I know you worked really hard to get to this place, but we're just super excited for you. And we know that you're going to take this education, this place that you've come to, and you're going to take it to the next level. We know that the world needs it. The world needs you. And everybody here at FSCJ is super proud of you. Thank you. From Professor Biglow to all of you, congratulations, FSCJ class of 2020. You have prevailed despite all of the challenges and obstacles of these difficult times. And while I may not have my trowel with me today, I can say that by being together, while being safely apart, we can banish this together. Congratulations, graduate. Job well done. Don't be a stranger. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I'm Dr. Jane Toria Burton, Associate Director of the Center for Civic Engagement. We are so very proud of you because you have proven yourselves to be strong, to be resilient, and to persevere until the very end. So with that, as you leave us, go forth and serve. Hi students, my name is Dr. Jentner, and I just want to say congratulations for your tremendous achievement graduating college this year. I look forward to hearing from you and staying in touch and I wish you all the best in the future. Oh, it's Elizabeth from the LLC. Congratulations, FSCJ class of 2020. We have helped you do research and separate fact from fiction. And in this most memorable year of graduation, I urge you to take the road as it forks and think critically and joyfully, and that will make all the difference. Congratulations again. To all FSCJ students, and especially the class of 2020, you are making history. You will be remembered for decades to come as leaders of the virtual world in the 21st century. Oh, the places you'll go. Congratulations. Today is your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. And you will succeed. Yes, you will indeed. 98 and three quarter percent guaranteed.
graduates, you'll move mountains. All the places you'll go. Congratulations, class of 2020. I'm Harvey Slintz. I teach business and employment law here at the college. You've done it. You went all the way. Congratulations on this milestone, and I wish you many more. Hi, my name is Igor, and I'm an academic advisor. I congratulate you on completing your degree. It may not have been easy, but you persevered and finished. I wish you well in your next educational or career pursuits. Hi, my name is Jackie Cloyne from the Recruitment and Admissions Department at FSCJ. To all the graduates, you've all worked so hard and now your hard work has finally paid off. I wish you the best of luck in the future and please remember you'll always be a member of the FSCJ family. Congratulations. Congratulations, FSCJ graduates, you did it. You now have the esteemed honor of wearing a funny hat just like this. Way to go. Logistics class of 2020, wow. I am so proud of you. Congratulations on your graduation. I wish you well and I know that you will exceed and do amazing things in the industry of logistics. Again, you have my sincerest congratulations. Normally around this time of year, I'm enjoying watching approximately 1,500 students walk across the stage to the cheers of their friends and family. However, given the current circumstances, I want to try to put a positive spin on things. And that is, class of 2020, you get to say that you are part of FSCJ's first virtual commencement ceremony. So class of 2020, congratulations. Hey there, FSCJ graduate. I know that this doesn't necessarily fit with the traditional vision of commencement, but you're part of a graduating class where the rules for how things used to be just don't necessarily apply. As odd and as disruptive as the world seems right now, in another way, you've been given a great gift. History no longer defines you or who you are. As you launch your new life as a graduate, you can reboot the world in a whole new way, so take advantage of that. You have the chance right now to change everything. So claim the future. It's yours. Graduation. It's a time to come together with your friends, your family, your peers, and to celebrate. This year, it might be different, but don't be disappointed. You have worked really hard and you've earned this. You've got your diploma. We're so proud of you. Congratulations. My experience in the honors program has, in a word, been life-changing. I wasn't sure what I wanted to do yet, and I knew that I wanted to get my AA, and uh, 
honestly, FSCJ was the most affordable for me, and I knew that there was a lot of opportunity. There was a lot of options for me with times and going around my work schedule, and that was ultimately what determined it. So with the honors program, it's not necessarily more, but you definitely dive deeper into the information that's given. So being involved in the honors program, you you have a huge support system. You're never alone, especially with Dr. Lamison, the uh, honors program director. She really helped me sit down and kind of plan um, and help me time manage. And I knew that with her helping me do that, taking her time out of her busy schedule, she I knew that I had a strong support system within that. The FSCJ family extends its congratulations to our Associate of Science degree graduates today. Congratulations to each and every one of you. We look forward to the impact that you will make in our community and in our workforce. You are a part of the economic engine that will serve the Jacksonville area. On behalf of the FSCJ family, congratulations to each and every one of you. We look forward to what you will accomplish in the future, and please know that FSCJ is always here for you as well. Congratulations, FSCJ graduates. You didn't just go through it, you grew through it, and that's going to serve you well in life. So onward and upward to your next successes. Congratulations. Congratulations, graduates, class of 2020. Congrats, 2020 grads, you did it. And you have all the creative thinking and the innovation that the world needs right now. So go out there and make the future a better place. We love you, we're proud of you, and we support you. COVID-19 literally affects every fiber of our way of life, a proof that one's health is of utmost importance. To our graduates, congratulations, and you have decided to accomplish extraordinary things. Remember that our end game is in our hearts and hands. Congratulations, and give yourself a big round of applause. You are awesome. Congratulations on all your hard work. I'm sure it'll pay off for your future. Good luck in all you do. Hey graduates, you did it. Congratulations. We are all so proud of you and so honored to play a small part in your life's journey. We wish you all the best in your future endeavors. Congratulations class of 2020. You did it. And we at FSCJ wish you the best. Congratulations, FSCJ class of 2020. You've done it. You've pushed through the unknown, the scary, things I could have never imagined would be in store for you. You've pushed through. You've made history by graduating through such amazing and crazy times. Now it's up to you, write your future. 
face your fears, do whatever you've imagined and more. It's always going to be unknown. There's always going to be crazy, but we have faith in you. Congratulations. I'm Dr. E and I want to say celebrate and then start plotting. This is just the start, wonderful graduates. So keep the momentum to strive forward. Find your happiness as you make an impact on the world. Congratulations, FSCJ Class of 2020. We are so proud of you. I'm Mrs. Bird from South Campus Assessment Center, and I want to say thank you for allowing me to be part of your journey. I know that we're in the middle of a strange time, but you still were able to accomplish all of your goals. And so now this is your time. Take your bow. Hey, Professor Sarah Stewart here. Just wanted to say congratulations to all the grads of 2020. Good work and good job getting through this crazy semester. Congratulations, graduates. This is Professor Shauna Corm from the Business Department sending you a virtual toast. I want to wish you all the best and may all your hopes and dreams come true. Go out into the world and do great things. Cheers. I knew that I wanted to do nursing when I pulled someone out of the water and they were seizing and I saw how EMS came and took them and um, just being the first person on the scene to get them out and to make sure they were okay, it's a, it's a, to know that I saved that man's life, like I want to do that. I knew that's what I wanted to do. Um, I feel like because when I was a kid I always had a basketball goal in front of my house so I would just go outside, me and my uncle and my family would just go and play. So I feel like just from bonding with them, it made me love the sport. You know, I had to pursue my dreams because I come to this country with another kind of ideas. So that was no who was, so I had to change uh, the ideas. So I had to change everything, so that's my choice. I chose, I chose to stay here in the United States because I had another choice to come back to my country then other hands will be easy. Come back to your country with your family, your language, you don't have to be worried about it. <laughs> but now I, I choose to stay here as a um, big challenge in my life. I have an older brother and older sister. We were both in college and then my mom is also going back to school. So between four of us and our family going to school, having to pay for all this tuition, and uh, my mom works a full-time job, my dad does too. So it just, it really helps them out, uh, not having to pay for my tuition because, you know, it just lets them use that money for other bills that we may have. So it's it, not only a huge burden off of me, but off of them too. Um, I would just want to say thank you, you know, for the opportunity they given me and also being able that they chose me to go out about their wishes and also help me get through my college experience. I'm honored, I'm more than happy to receive it. So I'm just more than thankful. I'm always appreciative of it. Thank you so much for the help, uh, the money that we received for the person to be up, give to me, uh, because that helped me to relieve a little bit. And I appreciate it because probably if I would not receive the money, probably I was not here 
doing this interview because probably I have to keep uh, and to let it go, my dreams or my classes, because I would be able to pay that. So I would say thank you so much, and I appreciate it. They continue to do it. To the donors, I'd like to say a huge thank you. Uh, the scholarships are a huge blessing to any college athlete or any college student in general. Um, kind of takes the burden off their shoulders, lets them kind of focus on their classes and uh, their family if they need. So it's definitely a huge help. I wanted to thank those at Florida Blue for the opportunity to get higher education at the speed that I'm getting it at and um, for making my personal life much easier and I, I wish I could thank you guys in person because it means so much to be given the opportunity that I have been given and I hope that you guys keep doing it because there's so many young adults out there that need help and will appreciate it just as much as I do. Hi, I'm Cleve Warren, and like you, we are FSCJ graduates. And I'm a proud graduate of FSCJ. Like you, FSCJ is the foundation stone for my, my career. I am awfully glad to welcome you to the Alumni Association that I've been a member of for some time, and I'm just inviting you in and hope that you'll stay in touch with FSCJ. This is home for me as it's home for you. We wish you well in your careers as you move on to other things from FSCJ. I trust that your experience has been great here, mine was. And it's a launching pad into all that you have planned to do in life. You can think back on your experience here at FSCJ and how this foundation stone provided the place for you to take a leap, if you will, into all that is waiting for you in our community and elsewhere in, our, in, in life. Good luck to you and welcome to the FSCJ Alumni Association. Again, on behalf of the entire FSCJ family, from our board of trustees, our faculty, staff, and administrators, we want to extend our congratulations to all of our graduates here in 2020. We thank you for being part of this show. We hope that you enjoyed our gift to all of our graduates from FSCJ. We hope that you would tune in on July 2nd to see the virtual ceremony that truly celebrates the accomplishments of all of our graduates. Until then, I want to thank WJXT for your support and making this possible. Congratulations once again to all of our FSCJ graduates, your family members, and your loved ones. Congratulations, and we wish you nothing but the best. Take care.
Channel 4, the local station, and High School 912 would like to thank our presenting sponsor, Community First Credit Union, along with our proud partners, Baptist Health, JEA, Baker Sporting Goods, Florida State College at Jacksonville, and Powering America, along with our honor roll sponsors.